Hello everybody, it's Michelle Patterson here. Whoa, with Angel Souls. I dropped, I dropped so many cards. We're gonna put them back. Hi, uh, <laughs> welcome. This is our daily inspiration card. Feel free to pair this up with other readings so you get a full picture. If you'd like a personal reading with me, just go to angelsouls444.com. And of course, I probably have a live event going on. By the time you see this, I've got writing over at Substack always something going on over at patreon all of that information all the updated information will be available in the description box below so our card for today ooh, father healing okay now this this could be literal for some of you this father healing but this could also talk about needing to heal around authority figures or divine masculine energy that's completely out of balance and they think that they're in charge of us okay whoever this might be some masculine who thinks that because they're in the masculine energy that they run everything, right? <laughs> okay. Your personal power increases as you give any father-related issues to heaven. Now, if you're a man watching this, you might have that kind of, I, I'm hearing contradictory kind of energy, like not understanding that you have divine feminine and divine masculine within you. So you might be a more sensitive person uh, who everybody puts you down for being so sensitive which isn't fair right <laughs> that's that's not nice but uh and we need more sensitive uh divine masculines out there that's you're the ones who are going to you know really help balance this planet as we bring up the divine uh feminine so the sun is rising on some issue here and more than anything I, again i feel like some of you probably have father issues that you want to work through but what i'm really getting in general here is that dare I say, standing up to a patriarchal kind of society and saying, okay, no more. An example that's popping up in my head would be how, especially with social media, this is just given another tool to um, put women down, uh, whether that is shaming women's bodies for one reason or another, acting like their opinion on a woman's body, again, this is just one example, acting like their opinion on a woman's body defines that woman. You know, we're hearing that a lot or uh, telling women they shouldn't be seen or, you know, there, there's a lot of that still going on. And I know people get exhausted by that. And so they don't want to listen to it, but it's happening. Okay. And that we're going to see these consistent examples of the divine feminine not making a comeback. She's never gone anywhere. Okay. It's not that, but being healed and taking the rightful equal place next to the divine masculine and of course as i said before everybody has both within them and so we're going to see some gradient of the combination of those energies but if the if the if it gets out of sync okay if it gets out of sync and one thinks even if there's a divine or the feminine energy thinks that she's above the masculine and is you know diminishing the masculine go back no that's not it that's not what we're doing no equal loving real connection complementing one another and that again can express in any way in any combination so we have to if, if you do have father issues okay but this is more about all of us healing whatever that masculine uh energy is and how we perceive it all right leave your comments down below i want to hear what you have to say about that so i'm sending you all so much love and take care